In this video, I'm going to show you how to move your blog from Squarespace 7.0 to Squarespace 7.1. First step is you're going to need this uh, Chrome extension from squarewebsites.org, link below this video. Once you've downloaded or once you've installed that extension, you're going to get this icon up here. Click on it and make sure the extension is enabled. Now, when you go over to your uh, page menu here, uh, you're going to see this extra arrow sign come up. And if you click on that, you can click get collection data. And what's that? what that's going to do is it's going to copy um, that content over. And if I click again here, I can see the collection that I just copied, the name of it, the type, and how many items. Now, uh, I think that stands for, in this case, how many posts, because I think I'm pretty sure there's just four, four posts there. Now, when I go over to my Squarespace 7.1 site, the site has to be live. It can't be in a trial mode for this to work. And I click on the icon again, and now I'm going to create from data, except I'm going to hold shift because I want to create this page or this new blog in my not linked section. And I can specify the type of collection. So I just want this to be a single column blog. Click confirm. And in a couple of seconds, it looks like that should be done. Click enter. And now I'm looking at the uh, the same four posts that I had there previously, right? Or that I had on my 7.0 site. So, um, very simple, quick and easy. As you can see, this took me less than a minute. That was only a handful of posts. Um, I did this for a collection with 135 items, and that took two and a half minutes. So, um, Whatever it is, it's, it's a matter of minutes. So again, hopefully you found this useful. Link below this video. I don't think it gets any easier than this. However, there are a couple other ways to do this. Um, one is to use WordPress. So I'm going to do another video where I try this using WordPress. Um, last thing to note is this extension does have a five day trial period and this is the one function that you can do on the trial um, but if you extend the trial or go further there's a bunch of other useful plugins that come with this that i happen to use as well so definitely recommend it peace